So here you see on this March morning a perfect example for uh, the use of unmanned aerial vehicles. We have a really thick fog layer. If we were attempt to, attempting to image this, this landscape, track animals, what have you, uh, we just simply can't do it with traditional aircraft. If we have smaller robotic craft, we can get on in there and we can uh, get under the fog or we can navigate even when there is fog uh, approximate to the observer, approximate to the pilot. So a whole variety of situations would uh, lend themselves more efficiently, more effective, effectively, and in some cases getting us to a place we simply couldn't get with traditional aircraft, we need unmanned aerial vehicles. As we descend into the fog, we don't want to stay in the fog, we want to come out into the clear airspace of effective use of these new tools.